right guys, today I am out here in Canton, North Canton on the Strip. I've wanted to film this for quite some time now, but I just never have done it yet. Um, what is in front of me here is what used to be a Hollywood video. There's now a whole bunch of different businesses in here. And I believe just right on the end here, this is where it was Hollywood video. That's the most prominent part. You know, you can still see the hills and the spotlights and everything. And you can even see up here by the AT&T sign where there used to be the Hollywood video sign. I think that looks so cool. I don't think I ever actually rented from Hollywood video, but I always thought it was such an awesome design. I honestly don't know if these still light up at night. I don't remember. I'm going to have to come through here maybe tonight and uh, and see if those are lit up, the spotlights. But the neon is all still in place, which is really cool. <laughs> I never really even rented from Blockbuster. I always rented from like the, the small mom and pop uh, video rental stores. And there was one called Video Time. That was always the one that I went to. But I've always appreciated Hollywood Video and, uh, and Movie Gallery and Blockbuster. I've always appreciated those for what they are. So there's another view of it. We've got AT&T on the end there. Pulp, Juice, and Smoothie Bar. Aladdin's Eatery, which the cool thing about this is that it reminds me of Aladdin's Castle that used to be the, uh, the arcade in the malls. The lettering is almost exactly the same. That is really awesome. Then we got Best Cuts and Men's Warehouse. I really like how, even though down here on the end, that was the Hollywood video, they kept the whole theme going with the, uh, the searchlights and everything. That's really cool, I love that. Man, it smells so good out here. There's so many restaurants and all the food, you can just smell it floating through the air, infiltrating your nostrils. <laughs> I want to look around the side here too, because as you can see, they take down the, uh, the spotlights, but they still kept up with, with a little bit of the theme that makes it look like the, uh, the Hollywood Hills up there. Not enough where you would really know what it is, Unless you're familiar with Hollywood video, of course. But let's go around the back here, because I think that that continues all through the back here as well. Yeah. Yeah, there it is. All down through the back, it continues there. And uh, like I said, on the side, you know, they, they took off the... Or they never even put them up. They never had the, the spotlights up on the back here, the neon. But um, but you can see up here at the corner, once it gets to the AT&T store, you can see on the top the peaks of what was the Hollywood Hills. And then up above here on the corner, you can see, I, I wouldn't necessarily call that a label scar, but you can see the outline of where it said uh, Hollywood Video. It would have been Hollywood across there, and then video at a little slant there. And the neon starts right at the top. And that continues around the side here. And look, even on Einstein Brothers, they have that same theme, just so that it ties in with this building. Yep, there's the spotlights. That's really cool. And that was, that was really smart of them to carry over that same theme, the design, onto this other uh, building over here. Otherwise, that may have looked kind of strange out here to have two different designs going. But there it is, guys. One last look at the former Hollywood video over here on the Strip in Canton. And just like I pointed out in the back, you can see where the sign was up here and where a uh, video would have been at a slant. So, pretty cool. Okay, so before we go, I stepped inside the AT&T store. I talked to the guy in there, it was really cool. I just wanted to see if there was anything inside there that was still reminiscent of the Hollywood video, and there was not. He told me that they do not light up the, uh, the neon anymore at night. They have uh, different LED lights and everything. 
but uh, but it's cool. It's cool that they've never taken that down, and um, you know that you can easily see that this was a Hollywood video. So, all right, guys, I'm out of here.